Hi Virgo, I'm Jennifer. I'm going to do your reading for you for the end of August. I'll find out what messages spirits have for you. We'll just cleanse the energy here really good. Okay, Virgo, let's just shuffle the cards a couple more times and we'll find out what messages are here for you. Okay, one more time. happening Virgo spirits okay we've got the knight of pentacles and the justice which is Libra energy and the hermit Virgo energy the knight of pentacles is very slow but I'm going to go back and clarify the cards this is coming out as your first card it's very slow, but I feel like this could be something you've been waiting for. And then we have justice. So the scales are going to be balanced when it comes to something in your life. And the hermit card. See you here as being very wise. We have the High Priestess and the King of Pentacles showing up. I feel like you're using your intuition when it comes to your money. The Three of Pentacles and the Strength card, Leo Energy. What's happening with Virgo? We have the Four of Cups. The Emperor, which is Aries Energy. And the Page of Wands. There could be a job that you're doing right now that you're not happy with. But we're going to go back and clarify the cards. I feel like there's something here that you're not happy with. And so I'm seeing you starting over new with the Page of Wands. Like there's good news. There's a message coming in here. Why is the Knight of Pentacles here? I feel like someone is wanting to offer you something, Virgo. It's like there's someone here wanting to offer you something, but they're holding back for some reason. They're holding back. They're like feeling confused, unable to make a decision with the Two of Swords. They're not making a decision. Why is justice here? You could be dealing with a legal matter. Um, I'm seeing you getting victory here. With justice and the king of swords. This is some type of legal matter. For some of you. Where I'm seeing you um, getting victory and success. And a huge celebration. It's like a wish fulfillment coming in. There's a decision here being made in your favor. Why is the hermit here?
Yeah, whoever this is that I'm seeing holding back. It's like they're wanting equal give and take with you. They're wanting to give to you, but they're holding back. This could be a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio too. I have the King of Cups here. They're staying in control of their emotions. And I feel like there's little to no communication with this person. And they're fighting an inner battle within themselves. This could have something to do with a marriage or a home. Why is the King of Pentacles here, Spirits? Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy with the King of Pentacles. I'm seeing um, success coming in for you. There's success and there's communication from someone, some type of truth being spoken here. When it comes to whoever this is holding back up here, you'll have to leave me a message and let me know. But there's, um, like, you could be opening up a business or something where it's going to be very successful. But I feel like you're, you're kind of, you're, trying to defend yourself and it's like you don't want to fight with this person anymore that i'm seeing showing up here at the beginning of the reading but they're coming in with some type of truth and i'm seeing you starting over new here why is the high priestess here the fool. Yeah, this person's going to take a leap of faith and stop holding back. I've got strong Pisces energy here. You could be dealing with a Capricorn. Let's see. I'm getting this energy of you starting over new, though. It's like you're using your intuition. There's a new connection coming in here for you, which this person could be a Pisces. But this is you looking at the big picture um, and taking a leap of faith towards something that you don't know all the answers to. You're willing to learn them as you go along. And there could be, I'm seeing um, some type of success. There could be a new job or something coming into your life that brings monetary gain. But there's a new connection showing up here too. Why is the Three of Pentacles here? There's someone here that you have a lot of love for, and I have the King and the Queen of Pentacles, so it's, with the Lover's card, it's like you felt very happy in this connection at one time. You felt like you belonged with this person. But um, they, I'm seeing a three-party situation here, and someone being in their ego. Someone could have addictions. But, um, I'm seeing you healing over this, but this person's coming back with some type of truth and communication. Why is the strength card here? This could be something you've been waiting for because maybe your intuition told you this person was going to come back. 
see someone's coming back that wants this ace of wands with you I'm kind of seeing you here waiting because I feel like you're, like I said, like your intuition was telling you they'd come back. I'm seeing them rushing in here with a message that they want this new passionate beginning with you. But I don't think you're having it. This is someone who is keeping secrets. I'm really seeing a three-party situation. They caused you a lot of heartbreak. But they're coming in with an apology here. With an emotional message. But I don't think you're going to take it. I'm seeing you not accepting it. Or not noticing it. Why is the emperor here? I'm seeing you looking at other options. Yeah, you're choosing a new option. I'm definitely seeing a new job coming in for you or some unexpected money. There's a lot of money showing up in your reading here. Why is the Page of Wands here? This could be like a move moving up in a position. The Emperor is like a boss. Now I'm seeing it's like you're you're interested in something new. There's something new here for you. And there's a tower moment coming in. Unexpected news of someone who's feeling like the wounded warrior. They're feeling um like they've been through a lot. This person misses you. And they want a new beginning with you. And I'm seeing you either putting up boundaries or just flat out cutting this person off. Why is the Queen of Swords here? Yeah, see, they're coming in with an emotional offer with the Page of Cups. This could be a new person, too, because I'm kind of getting the energy of two people showing up. I feel like you're not seeing this, but someone's feeling very heartbroken over you. They were looking at other options. Okay, so let's get a Angel Oracle card. What's happening with Virgo spirits? Release your ex. The time has come to clear your energy. And retreat. It's time to disconnect from the world. What does Virgo need to know? Attraction. You attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully. And let's get you a Moonology card. What does Virgo need to know? They're telling you to look at the bigger picture. And adjustments are required. And ask a question. What does Virgo need to know, spirits? They are saying they are telling you yes. Okay, and let's get one more. Listen, listen to your intuition. 
Okay, Virgo, so these are the messages that spirits have for you. I hope they help. And thank you so much for being here with me and liking and subscribing. And um, I will see you guys later. Bye, Virgo.